Hey guys, today I'm going to show you how to perfect pitch the Lanshan 2 tent. So this is a, a stop sack I bought from Amazon. So it's a larger one because the one they have is really shit and I don't like struggling that much with it. So yeah, I'm going to walk you through my, my pitch setup. So this is some tiny auxiliary cord from Decathlon. And here's my tent, my stakes. So here I go. Set the trekking poles to 45 inches or 115 centimeters. And let's go. So what I do is I first stake the four corners, but only the outer ones, then I stake the doors, and that's it. Then you adjust. I think I'm gonna go a bit higher. I'm gonna go 120. So, while keeping the doors together the doors stuck to the to the line I stake this this bad boy out and we can adjust later on but you can see it's already like semi freestanding so let's try it out here. And now I can tension everything. Everything down. Pretty much a perfect setup, super nice. I may want to readjust just this line, so I'm gonna do that right now. And you'll want to keep this, these tabs loose because in about half an hour the tent will uh, sag up a little bit. And then you can retighten and then go go to bed, and that will work just fine. Yay! So that's my method. Pretty bomb proof, huh? All right. Okay. One last thing you might want to do, if you're in a high wind situation, you might want to stake at the very end the inner tent corners to the outer ones. So that's like a super simple thing to do, especially right at the end. That will also give you maximum inner space. And yeah, then you can also stake the head spacing area. Or if you're near a tree, ideally you want to st st set this up a little bit higher. But yeah, this works as well. So this is the tent now set up. I usually just do one uh, side guideline just for my head, my feet. I usually don't care. 
but yeah you have the option so you get a super wide spacing that's one of the best tubules you can fit one dog on e either end and this is my Thermares Neo Air speed valve large so this is a long and wide path and you can see I still have maybe about two inches or three inches of space on either end so it's pretty good ah, mosquitoes. so this is the space I get with that setup pretty great my feet touch a tiny bit but it's okay thanks for watching